all right so in today's video i'm gonna show you how to get all five raid keys for the new raid operation iron horse this is also how you get the new raid exotic called the ravenous so after you kill the first boss you can get the first key so keep running forward until you get to this spot right here you want to pull this lever on this wi-fi station this will activate one random wi-fi box in the first raid boss room so head back there look for the one that you can interact with there is a few boxes on the first floor on each side so just keep looking for it i don't have that good footage for this title but you will easily find it just interact with it and you will get a spark plug head all the way back and put the plug in the generator and that will open the window right here and so this is time based so have teammates be ready so they can toss a grenade that will uh, break the lock and open the door now just run all the way back and get your first key There's also a backpack trophy key here, which is up on this thing behind the, the key. I don't know what it's called. But yeah, that's the first key. So for the second key, it's also time-based. So you want to activate it right here on the panel. Because that will start the encounter and spawn NPCs. So there will be a grenader tank spawning and he will drop the key that you need though. But to spawn the tank, you need to shoot two boxes. This one is the first one. And after you hit that, it will activate the second box. And to hit the second box, you have to get up right here. And when you hit that one, that will spawn the tank. Kill him as soon as you can and he will drop the key so you can get your second key. There's also another backpack trophy here as well. The third key is actually right ahead and you might have seen the clip on how we got completely destroyed here on the world first race by the snipers. Deal with the snipers. Up start, yeah. What? Okay. Oh my god. Oh. Hey, I got one shot, one million. Yep. So you want to have one to two guys with a bullet king or any LMG and you suppress the snipers. While you have the rest of the guys pushing up. You want to have a minimum of two people on each side. So kill the NPCs, but don't kill the snipers. They will spawn one RPG ad on each side in the back. Kill those and get their rockets. Then RPG each pipe on the side. Then you want to have two people on each side going up to the valve here. And then you have to press them at the same time. And make sure the snipers are still alive. Otherwise the key won't drop. Go up and pick up the key and move ahead. For the next part you have to shoot three boxes in a short amount of time. So you need three people ready to shoot each box because there will be a container and such blocking them after you start the encounter. So you need to do this really really fast. So I have like two people on each box. So yeah I will show you the spots right now and this is after the encounter. So some of the containers will be in the way and such. But yeah the first box you can find right here. You have the second one right here and the third one is up here. But keep in mind, these will all be blocked. So you gotta be really prepared for this and have at least two guys on each. I think is the best way to go. Have a guy count down and press the button to start the encounter. And just hit the boxes instantly. Like you have a few seconds, maybe a second or two. So you gotta be fast.
Then for the fourth key, it's the easiest one. It's on the way to the last boss. You just rush there and stop the train like usual. When you stop the train, run back down the stairs and run it to the room right here. And you got your fourth key. The fifth and the last key you will get from the end boss. So whenever you actually clear the raid, you will get the key. And you can now open the loot box, which is located right inside here. And this have the highest chance for the exotic rifle Ravenous. But you can also get it from uh, bosses I heard, but it's an extremely low drop chance. I hope this video was helpful to you guys. And I know I'm quite late, but I've been having a break from Division on YouTube this month. And I'm just trying to focus on other stuff. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed it and see you guys in the next one.